Wind is measured in different ways. Look at the leaves. Focus on the flowers. The flags really fly when it picks up. At the airport, a wind sock is a basic guide to wind speed and direction. Don't be fooled by the blue skies. Parking brake is set. Pilots pay attention to all the details. Instruments and computers provide guidance. Fin strobe on down. Fin strobe is on and down. Mixture full forward. Mixture full forward. A smooth trip can quickly turn into a very bumpy ride without notice. Rough air currents can rattle a flight in any size plane, sending luggage into the aisle, passengers into a panic. A flight can be disrupted in a matter of seconds, all because of the wind. Technically, turbulence. Airflow and changes in air speed or wind speed and direction, potentially rapid changes that occur because very often heating of the air. Long Island has a deep history in the aviation industry. We visited Farmingdale State College Aviation Center to talk turbulence with Michael Canders, the center director and a pilot. I think there's been an increase in turbulence from the time when I started flying. You read of more airlines and more incidents where turbulence has affected the flight to some extent where people are being injured. New research shows turbulence has been increasing. Atmospheric scientists in England studied the jet stream and found changes related to climate have increased instability in the air and irregular air movements. It's something that maybe requires a little more attention because of the, the global changes in climate. Biggest challenge for pilots is weather. So that's the variability that we all have to deal with every time we fly. The National Transportation Safety Board also released a report on preventing turbulence-related injuries. It found most people who were injured were not wearing seatbelts. Travelers know the weather impacts plans all the time. You might not take off as scheduled. Once in the air, the weather remains a major concern for flight crews. That's why pilots say you should always listen when the captain turns on that fastened seatbelt sign. I'm just starting out as a part-time flight instructor here. My eventual goal will be to work for the airlines. Sean Froman graduated from the Farmingdale State College Aviation Center. Pilots in the crew have to be ready for anything. We are very dedicated to safety. Currents can happen very quickly without warning, and I think in some of the cases we've seen recently, that has happened. So best advice, strap in. The, the men and women driving up front, they're strapped in, so everybody needs to stay secure and, and protect themselves against turbulence. Fasten your seatbelts, it could be a bumpy ride. On Long Island, Greg Mocker, PIX11 News.